Good morning, guys. It's a packing day today, and it's a complicated day. Yesterday has been a hard day. It's second, 22nd of uh, September. Yesterday, our president in Russia has announced uh, partial mobilization, and people are panicking. People are trying to leave the country because they don't want to participate in all of that. They don't want to participate in this war. There are about 300,000 of people who are going to be mobilized this at the moment, the most um, valuable ones in the military sense. And all the others who have just have army experience or something like that are panicking now because they're scared that they will be next. But I, I, I don't know. I don't know if they will be next or not. Nobody knows. These times are so uncertain and just nobody understands anything. <laughs> And people, many people are trying to leave. Our friends have been calling us all day long yesterday and several families are trying to leave now. Uh, they are on the border, trying to cross the border to Georgia, to our place. And they've been there for several hours already, so the whole night. And now it's early in the morning and I'm trying to pack before they come because they'll be staying in our house. Till, the, till we move in the three days, I think we're moving. They'll stay with us and then, I don't know, maybe they'll go to Turkey or maybe they'll find something here in Georgia. Nobody knows. No, we don't even know if they'll be able to cross the border or not. But you, pro you probably can see my, my just sleepless face. I've been so nervous for the past days and I haven't been sleeping and also we have a newborn so i haven't been sleeping because of the newborn too so i'm just so tired i'll be packing now because i want to pack our boxes before our friends come because there is just a mess in this house like i'll show you at the moment it's not the house for for having guests over just everything is is out of control because i've been decluttering and i just left everything in the places as it was because i knew i'll be packing just in a couple of days. This room is just a total chaos. <laughs> it's just completely out of control. And also we don't need to pack uh, our bed sheets and pillows and blankets now because they will use them for our friends and I don't even know if I'm glad about it or not because the whole situation is just so upsetting, like it's so hard. I don't have anybody who I know that will be mobilized for sure. I have some people that I can think they might be uh, because they've been serving in the army under contract or something like that. So I have a dad and a brother in Russia too, but they are not in the mobilized category, but I'm still worried about them because you never know what tomorrow will bring in this in these times. I'll start with the most useless items like books and decor pieces and documents. <laughs> well, they're not useless, but in terms of moving, we don't need them up for everyday use. So I'll just pack them to not see them anymore. Мне кажется, она уже спит. Проснулась. Толи is putting Agatha to sleep, and I'm here with this little, with this little chubby baby. The cat is here too. Толи put Agatha to sleep, but I've already started talking, so. To continue it's just crazy to me like how how i can live in another country and have a job have an income provide for my family because so many people want to live but they have their businesses their jobs their apartments their cars in russia and they can't but they want to we have so many friends talking to us and saying that they want to live but they can't they're scared because of everything that is happening and I'm just so thankful to be able to live here. So thankful to uh, patrons and my patrons. So thankful for YouTube ads. Just 
everything that helps me to just be here and not have to work in Georgia, but have an income, do something that I like actually, just that's, that seems crazy to me. Like this video is about packing, probably <laughs> not so much because I have a lot of uh, I mean, it's just talking about Russia and mobilization in Russia and just all of that. It's raining today. It's so dark in the house. I mean, it hasn't been raining for several months and today it's just raining. Probably because of everybody's mood now. So I packed Agatha's toys, uh, except big ones, like the stroller and a couple of others. It's a lot, Так я не поняла, кто отлынивает от работы. Видите, я работаю. Agatha is a professional packer. Что это? Это для пластилина. Ножички для пластилина. А да, а это. И а это кара карандаш рисовать. Я его. Не работает? Нет. Работает. Не работает? Ну ладно. Не работает? Что там? Уф, уф. Сильно. Think about putting all the boxes here on the first floor so we'll know how many we have and just all of the stuff we will take with us. Это твой ремень? Да. А он тебе нужен? Да. Mm -hmm. Мы с тобой покупали, ты не помнишь? Нет. <laughs> давай, давай, аккуратно. Да. Давай. Иди, иди. Ага, спасибо. I put all the clothes that we don't need um, in this suitcase. All of our clothes mixed together. And I put toilets, jackets that need a little bit more gentle care on top. And here I took everything out of this wardrobe. I keep, like these are 
toilet clothes. Uh, these are my clothes and these are Adeline's. And here are Agatha's just for the next several days. Here is a mix of random things. And I keep a little bit more clothes for uh, kids because you never know when they will get dirty and the weather also, I don't know, just for me it's for t-shirts, <laughs> basically. We also have that uh, big cage for rats, but I think we'll get rid of it because it's a wooden cage and it accumulates the smell, so we've had it for almost a year and it's a little bit stinky <laughs> and uh, I've ordered a metal cage and we have a small uh, cage for red transportation I think we'll use it for several days before my dad comes and brings the metal cage that I've ordered from Russia so the reds are moving too <laughs> Have prepared the bed for our friends and the towels. We'll prepare the next room because they all need both of them. And they are still on the border. They've been there since 4 a.m. And now it's 5 p.m. So like a little bit more and it will be the whole day. <laughs> so yeah, um, they're still on the border. I, I hope they'll pass. So I'm preparing the rooms. But yeah, we're still waiting <laughs> for the message about the border. <laughs> so we packed everything it's an evening already we're still waiting for our friends to cross the border um anyway let me show you our boxes so this is all of our stuff there is a lot of space left and here is a lot of space left but we also have bed sheets and pillows and blankets to put there so i think they'll take all the space and there are just random little things that we'll take here is the mattress from agatha's bed so so thank you guys for packing with us and i hope to see you in my next video from a new place bye bye